G'day and welcome to part 57 of my Gondor Divide and Conquer campaign, Total War campaign. Of course, Divide and Conquer is a mod for Medieval 2 Total War, where we dive into the world of Middle Earth. Yay, Tangle 12, welcome to the stream. Uh, now, last time we left this, last Saturday, I tried to do a quick and dirty little order resolve here. Because I was ending the stream, it was unsuccessful. It was stupid. We were like three to one. They had like three units. We had a whole army, and for some reason, the order is also we lost. And I thought that I was calling bullshit on that. So uh, off stream, I reloaded, fought the battle manually, and lost like pff, fifty dudes. It was like nothing. So it was an absolute joke. So I refought that, uh, and that was about all I did off stream so that's why we now have that captured there now because there's no way we're ever going to lose it i would have fought it manually if i wasn't very much over time as it was um i do notice there are some rohirrim here i don't have enough gold to, tr to hire them i'd like to get those just to add a bit of cab to this force because even one unit of cab can really make a huge difference uh the plan for today is to get rid of isengard I think we've significantly hampered them. Like we've taken back all of pretty much Rohan's core lands. Uh, like we've got all the big cities, we've got Isengard, we've got all of Isengard's core lands. So the only thing that we haven't taken is this Bregnas over on the on the border here. So we want to try and take Bregnas, and then I know there's I think another army traipsing around somewhere here, like probably a half stack, maybe more half stack. So I'm trying to gather together forces. I know I've got like bits and pieces of forces here. So I'm going to get some cab. This will make a huge difference. And I think with that cab, we try and make a move because it's still four turns, three turns, two turns. Like I can start training those next turn. So that'll be good. I'll have some troops left in Herluin's Rest um, in case they sort of circle around. And with those two units plus the Royal Armory, I should be able to defend a fairly sizable force. But hopefully we meet them on the open field with the cab. That's the plan. I'm so proud of Herluin's Rest. We built this settlement up from the ground, basically. Um, and now it's a pretty much a fully Gondorian settlement. Yeah, 91%. I mean, we, we've really built this place. I'm really proud of that. Uh, so that's the plan for today. We're, we're pumping all resources into the bat, into the, the fight in the north. Um, we can't get troops from these settlements right now because of culture. But... We can send them from Kalanhad and Denethor's Fall if we, if we, we, we do need to keep sending them across. Anyone here that's trained, we're sending straight across. Let's grab those. Uh, I don't really want to send militia. I want to send the Gondor cavalry militia. I guess we can hire some Rohirrim on the way. Now, in terms of what's happening with the war with Mordor, um, this has been our focus over in Isengard. We're not really looking on doing, we're just holding here right now uh, as best as we possibly can. This is upgrading. It's one turn away from having, actually think about how we need to defend that now, so we have to defend differently. Herondros is one unit short of full stack. I don't know why that is the case. Uh, maybe we lost them. Anyway, I need to chuck a fountain guard in there in a moment. Like, let's go grab those two fountain guards and chuck them into this Port. By your command. Okay, so we still have free upkeep, and that way units training here will get free upkeep as well. Uh, Karasast. I can't get decent units here. I'm building roads, economic center there. Hype, yep. Bring in hype. And now in the south, we're blockading all their ports. We're trying to eliminate any uh, naval presence that they could possibly have. This army is like trying to attack this fort which you know let them try um and then over here we have fanalond we train him who is still holding out against all these armies here and lin here who how is lin here's lin here's garrison looking like oh quite strong at the moment oh lots of cav in there though that's not great i have to do a bit of a sally out all that cav is not great for defense we do have some axemen there, pikemen, some good units. Good units. 
What are they? What are they bringing? Ooh, trollmen. Not a lot of cav actually, which is an issue, because we're being easily beating the cav. Uh, we do have some reinforcements here, which we can bring across. Is this still only got one tier of armory? Yeah, it does only have one tier of armory. All right, so in the south we're looking to hold as well uh, and just suffocate basically with the with the navy. Umbar is still holding in the south. No more upgrades there. The merchants are doing trash. I looked at the, I remember at the end of last stream, I got two merchants and we're making 517 from the two merchants. Service. So he's only generating 262 gold. I might have to do 31, I'm just not making a lot of gold. Is that because we can't get the trade out from Umbar because we're being like sort of besieged here? I don't know. I don't know how that operates. I mean, as I've said before, trade in this game is really weird. My other merchant's over here. He's only getting 150 gold from that. What you get from this? 15? 11? I, mean, I just don't think there's any good... Eleven. Like, I don't know, my trade income just seems to have gone down. Maybe it's because I don't have anyone to trade with. I think it's maybe because I've got no one to trade with. I think that's the issue. Like, I think I'm trading with Enithwraith. I think I am. And if I can hook up trade with Lothlorien, that would be good. Sort of in the north there. No sound alerts. I'll be funky. Uh, no, I don't have any sound alerts. Um, currently. This is something, uh, it's, it's a bit, is this something on my, on my thought process, I'd be funky? It's just a bit hard. Um, <laughs> uh, they're coming in here. A bit hard having the full-time job. Um, so I sort of got to wait for some holidays to have some time to do things in between that and the family. It's sort of like, uh, where are we? Gone to a battle. When I get the, when I get the holidays, I can do some more things, you know. This is going to be rough. They have a lot of trollman units. Mm, that's actually a really high tier army. Let them have it, man. And and it's not it's not entirely my style. Um, when I do eventually get them on, I'll be funky. They'll probably be reasonably pricey. Um, I know it's it's not really my thing. Odd considering I come into you and pay a, play a sound alert every time I get a chance. How's it going though? Yeah, great. Um, sad day here, so... Oh, where are they forming up over here? Sad day, so Saturday afternoon. I'm feeling pretty good. Um, yeah, no, no real concerns. Now, I think I just have to use... There's no second army here. Oh, you were talking to Tangled. I didn't even realize. <laughs> oh, dearie me. I've got a fair amount of... Okay. That's the cab. Like six cab. There's still a lot of infantry. Still a lot of infantry. I think we have the cab all over here. And we send them out. We get the cab here. We'll run them over. Most of them are here. I think they're all in this area. The baby shark I originally had set for 10,000 bits decided to run a sale on it. It's now on 5,000. <laughs> yeah. Um, I, I, uh, yeah, it's, it's not, it's not entirely my thing. I'm, I'm about the conversation, you know. Um, I love, a lot of people come in and have a chat. Um, you know, say hello and, uh, enjoy the content. I'm, I'm about the conversation and the content uh, on this stream. Yeah, I, I actually hate the Baby Shark um, song. It's actually probably in my top three uh, <laughs> things that I hate the most is that Baby Shark song. I think the archer is going to be better used over here shooting down. 
when they break through the gates. I'm just, I'm using, I'm engaging the frontal cortex here. Engaging the frontal cortex. And I'm thinking about it. I think if we shoot back down here and leave this open, um, we will get a lot of value out of those archers. Now, in terms of the wall defense, we just want our... Lemonin, where's our bundle defenders? Set them up here. Tangled 12. Somewhat nice. Uh, yeah. Oh, look, can we hold spears? I mean, we have to set these up properly once the, once the battle starts because they're being painful. Just come over here. Come over here somewhere and I'll set you up where I need you to be. As long as we have our walls defended. Who's coming up here? Is that... Trollmen champions? Oh, dear. Oh, yeah. The Lemon and Clans going to deal with that. Um, yeah, get them up there. Would like some other swordsmen potentially on the wall over here. In case that comes through. We have one unit of cav, possibly. Just stand over here. No. You, come here. Activate that tower. Good. And you probably come here as well. Activate that tower. Just make sure those towers are shooting at that anything coming in there. And then we know our other swordsman unit. No, not you. You. I do have another swordsman unit here. Here he is. I knew I had him somewhere. Come over here and deal with the other siege tower. Now, hopefully the siege towers get burnt. That's the plan anyway. Siege towers get burnt and then we're, we're all good to go, basically. That's the plan. But, you know... Got a plan for things not going well. You guys are going to be a flanking force as they come through the gate. And I've just got plenty of spears left over, I think. Yeah. Plenty of spears left over. So you come over here. Probably do want one spear unit. If I had a trash unit, I'd use it. But it's going to be the sacrifice unit over here. Because I want the archers really firing in here. You guys are going to be one unit on that side, but we're going to put the one unit here. Maybe, maybe i just put this here just to slow them down, and then I hold these guys here. Yeah, that's better. And then those swordsmen can come down and support if need be. There we go. Now, now we're thinking with portals. I think that's everyone. I guess we'll find out. Oh, it's over here. No, we're good. Hi. Let's do it. Bikes, just position a little more across that gap. Can you? Go like there. Let's come across a bit. That there. Turn sideways. Turn sideways. Game on. Battle on. Yeah, we're coming in. So if we could burn this battering ram, that'd be great. That'd buy a little bit of time, but I'd much prefer to burn the, the towers. The ladders are going to get up on the wall either way. Um, so we got our, our swordsmen here waiting to meet them as they get up over the wall. Uh, what do we have over here? Yeah, nice, nice, nice. Those towers are shooting across at them. Beautiful. Wait, I put my general. Oh, where are you? I don't want you there. Come over here. Mr. General, come our over here. Ladders have reached our walls. It's time for butchers. Oh, yeah, there goes one siege tower. Very nice. Can we get the second one as well? 28%. It's burning. No. All right, good. So that siege tower is no threat. So they're going to come through the middle. Where are those ladders going up? Ladders, 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 ladders. Yeah, they're coming up here. Okay, so can you guys come around more to there. Our enemy. The enemy siege come around, come around. Our walls. I don't really want... I mean, the archers will hold their own because they are Gondor archers. So they'll... Um, the enemy's siege tower is naught but kindling now. Second siege tower gone as well. No, not yet. Curses! Right. The enemy are battering down our gates! You lads can probably get off the wall, honestly. Uh, actually. But if they get in here, let's just... Uh, just hold there, hold there for the time being. Hold, hold, hold. Hold, yeah, get the popcorn out. One siege tower down. They're coming up over these ladders. We've knocked down one ladder. Go 
Perlman Warriors are wavering, so yeah, they got no support, they should go down. Swordsman, hit them as they come over. Yeah, don't give them a chance to make a foothold. They will go. Yes, hold. Hold. They're battering down the gate. There goes the siege chest. Sweet. Awesome. Oh, we killed a bunch of them as well, I think. They're coming up to these ladders. Yeah. Look, this is easy. Easy battle. Easy battle. I mean, they're going to get through the gate here, and it's going to be a bit of carnage, but that's okay. Uh, they're coming in. Freedom. For the west. For Gondor. Friggin' hold. Send an artist. Shoot me a bit. Come on. In they come. They've broken down the gate. Now they're just going to charge through. Now I do have my cab ready to... I'll bring this cab out now. To our defense or all will be lost. All right. Hold. 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 Old. They're coming up here as well. Secondary forces. They're getting absolutely blasted. Okay, I want the archers. Uh, not just yet. Well, they are All right, maybe the archer plan has to be put on hold. All right, let's go. Get in there. Stream out. Stream out of the gate behind them. Yep. Oh, look, you guys didn't know this, did you? Spring the trap. Spring the trap. Where's the general? General, what are you doing back there? Get over here. Yeah, boys, you're going to try and use your mass to get through here, but it's not going to work. Our troops are too strong. Oh, yeah, look. The trap. Charge. Yes, come on in here. We've, we've pulled, this was this actually worked really well. We pulled these men out of the walls behind them, and now they're just completely surrounded. Yeah, they're just, they're just breaking. They're just breaking. They got nothing. They got nothing. Absolutely nothing. Uh, you, you come out to this side. We'll have some cav around. You two. Yeah, come out. And we just clean them up as they try and run away. Turned out to be a really easy battle. I mean, we've been defending city. We've been defending the city here against multiple stacks. So uh, to only have one army, you know, they didn't really have much of a chance. And their general died reasonably early. I mean, yeah, they've still got some troops coming through here, but they're just surrounded. You didn't make a foothold. The, the pikemen held, and uh, and they got nothing really. The side attacks failed. Held them off here on the walls. Archers are actually still here ready to fire if we need them. We don't even need them. They're just completely... They're, they're done. They're completely done. Where are you guys? Gondor defenders. Yep, you guys held too. Yeah, nothing. Let's speed it up. They're routing. You... Oh, kit. Uh, just wait till they get out of our tower range so we don't shoot our own troops. Yeah, they're, they're full, full route. You lads think that you're getting out of here, do you? Uh, Serpent Bladesman. Give them a charge. Give it to them, lads. Go and do a cavalry. Oh, yeah. Wow, they're actually held against the charge. I mean, Gondor Cavalry aren't great on the charge. I probably should have sent the, the Knights of the Silver Swan, but still, I'm surprised they actually held there because they were routing. Hey, let's see how you go a second time, shall we? Pull back. Charge again. Charge downhill, surely. Come on, Gondor Cav. Surely you're not useless. Prove yourself not useless. That was a pretty good charge, but still, they're not they're not really charging cavalry, they're more anti-cav cav. Hey, they're, they're completely done. No problem at all. Okay, so let's speed it all the way up. I need to be slow now.
52. Now charge. I think we've got more than 85%. Yeah, we just need to, just need to route this last unit and we're good. The enemy there we army flees the board by the victory awesome. we have won here today. We had the most kills. 86 on the Gondor Cav actually after me trashing them. 86, but our prisoners caught. Look at this. This Gondor infantry. That's the infantry unit that came out off the walls. We just completely trapped them and they had nowhere to go. They just we just caught them. They were, they were trying to run away and we were just catching them as they were running. But the towers did a lot of work as well. This Gondor uh, infantry unit yeah, did really well. I mean, it's a good reason reason why tower, towns are good to defend in. Because you got the uh, support from the towers firing in. You get a lot of free kills. Free kills are good. Kills where you don't have to use your units to get them. So I've been saying the focus has been on taking Isengard and we're really just holding the forces in the south here. I mean, they're going to come in. That canned army. They don't really have much... I think they're all horsemen, really. They're a bunch of horsemen. And it's not like I've been preparing for Can to attack. It's not like I have a whole bunch of spearmen ready. Uh, you're going to siege that as well, are you? Come on. I mean, I'd like you to siege that. Honorith. Honorith. Is it a city? Yeah, sure. Why not? Merchant's Guild. Oh, actually. Yeah, yeah we actually don't have the money for it. Uh, this lad. The one thing I want to spend my money on this turn is to hire those Rohirrim. Okay, and now that army actually has uh, cavalry in it, quite strong. I'm gonna stick you. Well, they're not gonna last. We'll sally out and take them. The you can advance. I probably am. Hmm. Go to there for now. We do have some. Uh, it's absolutely nothing left here. Just holding that, holding that settlement. Why does Lothlorien not like me? We're literally fighting their, the Isengard who have taken their capital. Why do they not like us? They should be absolutely in love with us. They should be all over us, those elves. Yes, thank you, Gondor, for, for saving us. No, no, we don't like you. In fact, you, you, didn't, you, didn't get rid of, you didn't get rid of Isengard before they, they took our capital. You know, now we don't like you. It's... Uh, you two can march west. As you wish. Keep going. Go no All troops today. we can get to the war with Isengard yeah. is helpful. And, ho oh, ho where is it? Boromir City, otherwise known as Eastern Osgiliath, has been rebuilt. It's been rebuilt. Look at this. We now actually have... No longer is it a ruin. Both of these started as ruins. They're now both fully rebuilt. Walls. Towers. The glory of Gondor has been restored. Uh, and how much culture do we have here? 74%. What do we need for this? Please go down. 75%. So definitely get the army barracks now. Because we have the Numenorean Armourer. Very good. Name on this side. Probably just grab the Royal Hall so we can have some more free upkeep. Or roads. Roads are probably better. Get some roads. <laughs> We're having a little moat contest there, I see. Grable Toflas. Yeah, I mean, this army, I don't know what this army's doing. You sailed over here. I destroyed your ships so you couldn't get back. And now you're just chilling here. Um, you're just chilling. I mean, I'll just keep building units until I have enough to sally out and kill you, but sure. 66%. Grab a school. Uh, culture, culture, culture. Yes, grab a school. Okay, we are spread really thin. Oh, they brought this army across. Okay, so it's actually a bit damaged. The Berserkers are down to 17. So everyone else is fairly full strength. These guys are a little bit damaged. I think we sally out and we meet. We meet these I'm lads on the field. 
because we want to push them. If they can, if this unit, these units are separated from the rest here, I think we push them right now. We actually, oh, we actually got some units here as well. All right, so we're going to form up on this bridge. By your command. So we got some archers, some cav. Um, we're definitely going to send all of our good units into that army. Joining forces, and I mean, oh, I think we should send everything. Can they reach? No, they can't. I think we send everything. Assuming it's... Yeah, we'll hold. It's okay. The people, the people weren't rebel. They shouldn't rebel against us. I mean, they're pretty much 100% Dunedain. We do have the Royal Armory there, so it's not left completely undefended. Uh, then, these four units. See, they can reach Eisenrun. I mean, if they choose to siege Eisenrun... That would be a very poor decision on their part. As you wish. Joining forces now question, if I pull this guy out, yeah, it does maintain. I can even lower taxes if I need to. Want you in this army, I want two more. So we just leave... Just leave him there. Yeah. Okay, so that's a full stack, albeit got some militia in there but with that this army comes across we crush it and then we march west and take their last western settlement off Isengard that's the go sounds ready to upgrade Ethrin sure we have the money I mean we're making a lot of money per turn but <laughs> we still we still can't build everything that we want to. What are we making per turn? 19,000? It was 22,000 last turn. We moved some troops out of um, free upkeep, but... They've come in again. So that this army didn't get a chance to replenish, but we didn't really lose much. And what is it? It's just cav. It's all cav. So we're going to just slice them down when they come into the city. Yeah, they'll have an initial burst where they are quite um, strong just because of the amount of mass that they'll push through our units but they haven't got the infantry to follow it up two varic swordsmen one candish hunter that's it they've got three infantry units in the whole army so they can try and attack but it's not going to be successful i'd be more worried about this remnants of these haradrim forces <laughs> tangled 12 and ivy funky i love it i love it i've been i've been watching <laughs> whatever's going on over there it's fantastic how many units are here? Oh, lots of pike. Oh, shit. Five pikemen unit with silver armor. Well, that's actually... It's actually quite a strong army. I'm surprised they didn't attack. Actually, really surprised they didn't attack. I've got three archer units here. Trying to deal with those pikes, but still. It's the royal armor as well. I'm, I'm, I'm legitimately surprised they haven't attacked. I can't really go out and fight them. This is all good. Um, merchants can stay where they are. Being stupid, but it's fine. Onward. Let us okay, We're still here. allies with them, aren't we? We're still trading, yeah. Okay. Now we go over to this part. It's fine. So I think we use this army to take them out, but let's first probably try and kill these three. Marching to war. The day is ours. Captain, war, little captain here with. Look at this. This is the benefit of taking out... This is the benefit of taking out recruitment centers. We've taken out their recruitment centers. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my goodness. We have daylight. Yeah, I'll do. Right. I mean, the cab are going to do most of the work here. Do we even have any archers? We do have one unit of archers. Uh, infantry, line yourselves up. Pretty simple battle. Not really much cause for uh, too many tactics here. We'll simply do. Uh, yeah, archers behind. Who's the captain? One of the cab units? Okay. Uh, 
don't fire at will because I don't want you to spear your own men in the back. And then whatever cav remnants we have left over, you're just going to circle around, do the odd recharge, and that will be that. Alright. Let's move forward. Are they going to run up the hill? Oh, they are too. Print. Can we please get the archers in range? Shoot, 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 shoot. Okay, out of range again. Okay. I don't know quite where they're going to. Like, are they going actually right up this hill? Wolf Wizard, welcome to the stream. Get on in here. Whoa, Wolf Wizard. Nice emotes, dude. Are they all your are they your emotes? No. Yeah, say. Very Dota themed emotes there. Got a BKB. It's Crystal Maiden. Love to see Crystal Maiden. They're purge emotes. <laughs> oh, that's cool. <laughs> that's our divine ones, nice. Uh, that's funny. They have archers? Uh, no, they don't have archers, so we can just shoot them. Bring the cab around. Run and speed it up. Shoot them a bit, make them come at us. They don't have archers, so they're gonna have to come at some point. Shoot the orc fighters, they don't have shields. And free kills on them. How are you today, Wolf Wizard, by the way? Looks like you're feeling pretty good, not gonna lie. Hey, Archer's still firing, they're still just taking a hit. I mean, I'm just gonna pull the cav around and give it to them. Poor Hunters, there's no way they're gonna... No way they're gonna stand up against this. They did run away there a little bit. That wasn't good. They're really being quite stubborn, aren't they? Um, uh, do I have eight bull on? I don't know if I actually have eight bull on. I have all the others. I have to look. them, change, change targets. If we continue like this, we will smash We've routed, we've routed the whole flank. Just one unit left. Just from well-timed matches. Match found, gonna lurk. No problem, thank you for, thank you for the lurk, I appreciate it. And thanks for dropping by, and uh, those, are, those are nice emotes. Purge has got some good emotes, so it's pretty cool. There he goes, the captain. Behold how our cowardly foe runs. Uh, just hold fire. Alright, uh, chase him down. Kill this one guy. Is no one's getting out? No one's this getting out. These are Saruman's goon, goon squad. The eight lost. What a what a clean battle. Couldn't have gone much better. I mean, we could have only had seven lost or six lost. That was pretty clean. Oh, it's at this point. I uh, say so we are we are on maximum maximum difficulty. You're short of that. Uh, so we're going to keep pushing. I mean, this it's funny, this Gondor campaign. We seem to grind for a long time. 
You seem to grind for a long time, making not much progress at all. And now in the space of like 10 turns, we have really made a bunch of progress. Good. I'll be able to isolate the cab here. Other catapults. Good. So we'll kill this catapult. That's isolated. Reinforcement army will come in. Very nice, very nice. Okay. And we're going to keep pushing on. Clean up these little remnants of forces. I mean, they separated their forces. That was their mistake. That was their error in judgment. Uh, we're going to do a full charge of the cab at the front here to get rid of this uh, catapult. And then we'll set up the infantry somewhat behind. Infantry. Once again, you two can chill at the back with the... Turn that off and with the archers. And where are you? Probably guard their flank as well a little bit. Yeah, that side. Okay. Let's do it. Now, don't start that again. <laughs> Brought up more men. Charge. All the reinforcements get it. I mean, they're gonna try and they're gonna leave this catapult alone, aren't they? Bad decision. Uh, definitely want you guys. Run, run, run. Get up. Loop around on that catapult crew, hit them from the side as well. I mean, we're going to lose a little bit of cav here because wolves have a bonus against cavalry, but... Okay. Much prefer to clear these guys out. Only half the enemy force remains. How are these catapult crews still holding here? And they're, they're absolutely surrounded by cavalry. As well, that far it will. Excuse me. Uh, oh, crash. I think I've actually had a crash. Uh, does it, does it want to respond? Give it a second. I don't know why it's done that. It does look like it's crashed. Uh, let's... Kill it. Alright. Come back in. This is why we save before going into battles. <laughs> this is why we save before going into battles. Hopefully, it's not something in the battle that's causing the crash. It was just random. Um, sometimes it's a particular unit or a particular uh, like part of the map with the with that unit. I mean, it's pretty hard to. I mean, the mod is ridiculously stable um, for a fifteen-year-old game. Um, but hopefully, it's not. If if it does crash a second time again, we might just have to um, auto win it. So we'll see how it goes. Because there's, well, there's no way we ever lose this battle. It's pretty easy. It's an easy battle. We'll clean them up very easily. I reckon 50, 60 losses maybe. But let's just try again. If we have a second crash, then there is definitely something wrong with this map or units or something. We've been using this army for a while. Could be something in the in the enemy army. Never know. The same thing. That. <clears throat> the enemy have brought up more men. Try that again. Knight. 
Charge! Ready. Charge! With great Knights speed. of the Silver Swan. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Down both sides, and strike pretty quick. Bloodied. It's actually going a lot better than last time. <laughs> There goes their captain. He didn't die before, so maybe that he was the issue. Behold how our cowardly foe runs. It's time to press the attack. Okay. Be good. Got them all. Sweet. Hopefully, it might have been something in that army that was causing a crash. Pull the cab over to this side. And let's advance the infantry. Keep it on time six. Nothing really happening. We'll just walk them though. Keep them nice and fresh. Don't want to tire them out. Cause <laughs> I gotta remember, I play with I play with playing with high elves on Wednesdays. High elves I can pretty much run everywhere, and then I get tired because I mean the elves they can they're pretty much near immortal, right? But uh, the men of Gondor. Humans, with all their faults, are not so infallible. They have plenty of plenty of issues, the old humans. They actually have multiple arch units there, so we're just going to come around here with the cav and completely wipe them. Let them charge in, that's fine. You lads can hit these guys, hit them, hit them. And then the Knights of the Silver Swan come in and hit this Orcman Spear gut in the rear. If we continue like this, we will what? smash the enemy. Across. Only half the enemy force remains. The enemy general flees like the coward. Our men are the Very enemy nice. general. Guard him well and make it so he can see us defeat the rest of his army. Behold how our cowardly foe runs. It's time to press the attack. Face him down. Make sure that we kill the whole army. We should be all good. Who's still chasing over here? <laughs> Just a spearman unit. Uh, I believe they are well and truly gone. That's yeah, okay. Exit battle. This is a clear 171 victory. lost. Well, I say 60. Double, double what I thought. That's okay. 171 is not much. And now we're pretty much clear to push on to Did we? Did we actually make it out? It's struggling. Something's happened. No. Our forces are well hidden. The trap is set. Rothberg. <laughs> hmm. We can push on to Rothberg with this army. The day is ours. Spy tells us that there's a substantial force in there. Ooh, actually a really good force. Can we actually take that? Maybe not. I think what we do is we just fall back. We can't siege at this turn anyway. So let's just fall back to the bridge. I do need to reset my settings since we reloaded the crash. Right. Awaiting your command. And we use this army to sally out. We leave behind one unit just to make sure that they don't By your rebel. Command. Perfect. Well concealed from the enemy here. Yeah. Your will, my lord. I'm gonna stick you. I'll take these Aren't lads as well. The and then that's assembled. that's sort of the Prepare rear the rear guarded as well and with that settlement sort of uh maintaining public order there with the one unit i think i just march 
these lads north to meet with that other army after this battle this is this is my general of course the game decided to pick the unit that had literally three guys left and that's the guy the general attached himself to oh he might maybe maybe this he maybe he was one of the mercenaries maybe he's a mercenary who has now embraced the ways of gondor and he still likes he's this is his three best lads that have survived the journey with him you know um maybe maybe that's what's going on um we got a very similar army to our other one i mean not you 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 don't die uh, okay. We've got a, quite an eclectic group of group of soldiers here. This is not a, a Bob standard Gondorian army. We've got Dun we've got uh Dunlendings in here, we've got militia, we've got some mercenaries, we got we got some Gondor uh mainline troops. I mean it is it's quite a it's quite a force. Quite an unusual force. We've got some some men from Penneth Gellin on the cav. Uh, yeah, it's quite a weird aren't they? actually have two of those. Uh, who's left? Did you? Yeah. Oh no, a couple of lads over here. Who's this? Pikes. I don't know why I didn't put you in the main line. Pikes, get over here. Cool. You're fine, just get off defensive mode. You lads can be the, the bodyguard of the of the bodyguard, considering they don't have anybody. Alright. This will be pretty much just a straight up and down brawl. Oh, I've got some arch militia as well, who cares? Oh they have they have catapults. Oh we gotta rush. Rush, 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 run. Don't don't let them get into Have sweep around to the left. Meet them. Meet them head on. Don't let the catapult fire. Quick, 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 quick. Catapults can pretty much like almost one shot a unit. So if they if they are accurate, which they're often not, but you gotta be careful with them because they will absolutely annihilate you oh oh there goes five brave souls come on keep running keep running keep running keep running where are the cab at get around the back they don't have cab themselves so that's our advantage come on run 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 keep sprinting i know you're gonna be tired warmed up you can tie it up the hill looks like they're coming down anyway Hit him. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Okay, you. Hit them. Okay. this see if we can break a flank hit him hit him hard hit him hard yep broke her nice break that flank and then you guys push around push around oh they're still firing where's my you get over that's not good we didn't shut them down, but we've broken one flank, so now we can collapse with the infantry. Stop the catapult from firing. Right, pull out, that'll be enough for now. Pikeman on this side will push through, hopefully. Yeah, Pikeman will push through very nicely. Uh, yeah, we've, we've starting to collapse on the flanks. 
So they are in serious trouble. Catapults off their crew, off their machines. And let's see if we can get another juicy little break. Right in the middle here. Let's go. So go, go for you again. Go for the archers. Because this is already breaking here. Hold fire. Hold fire. The enemy are badly bloodied. Hold fire. Have lost half Give it to them. Oh, yeah. Oh, good charge. That completely roasted them. What? Run. Run and get out. Yep, we've cut that flank as well. Okay, so now they're just really pretty much in the middle. Get those archers. There goes their captain. Definitely not our captain. Yeah, I think that's going to pretty much do them in. Yeah. There goes the, the mass route. Only one unit of cab though, so I'm going to have to chase him down with that. Send descent. The enemy army flees the field. Pursue and run them down. Just a little more. Give yourself some more XP. Going on two silver chevrons at the moment. Still got a little bit to go to get max out. Kill this catapult crew. Honestly, I don't want it surviving. Just in case. Eight catapults. Such a cheats, such a cheats weapon, catapults. I'm just gonna fire a big flaming ball at you. No, meet me. Meet me face to face with your sword blade. That's what I like to see. Nice. Very nice, very nice. 269. Nice. Lost. Who killed the most? I think Celso one done landing berserkers 168. Even more than the cavalry. The berserkers. Just cut through the middle. Very well done, berserkers. The men of Dunland who are redeeming themselves. So they can march north to the bridge. Now, can they merge anyone? Can you merge anyone? Okay. So, we're going to march you north. Although, I would like to... I don't think I need the full army. But we can merge. If you have a spearman unit... We'll send you... You... You and you. Yes. Because you'll merge. Will, my lord. And then three more. Three more Orders. units. Uh, my lord. One, two. <laughs> I'm sending. I'm sending the dregs. Uh, maybe not. Maybe I shouldn't send the dregs. Maybe I should send some decent ones. Uh, Zerkers Your did will, well. The marchers. And they have cav in that army, don't they? Order, they have plenty of cav, so... Archers, Berserkers, and... And there's other archers. Okay. And the rest of you, we're going to march this way. And meet up with this army. Okay. Very nice. Okay. He does some spies. I can advance further forward to see what's going on. I think we'll do that. You jump forward about there. Keep an eye on what's going on. You go further up to here. You replace him. So this is their faction leader. I mean, he's just a nobody orc. We've killed all their decent uh, faction leaders. Psychotic Unicorn. I. How you going, Psychotic Unicorn? How are you today? Welcome, 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 welcome to the stream. 
We are currently mopping up orcs. Mopping up Isengard units. Now we want to send you to go scout out whatever's happening over here. Approaching quietly. Tomorrow's journey planned out. I shall continue tomorrow. Now, are they on low taxes? They are. So I think we can probably spare like one more of these guys. Protect the blood of Numenor. Yeah, just to As you wait, Captain of Gondor. Merge. And probably you two. Merge. Yeah. Ready your weapons. Awaiting your command. Now you can't merge. And do I have Ready pikemen in this army? We do have pikemen. As you wish. No sense to right, cool. So we'll send those, and you lads are heading over here. Let us set up camp here. Captain of Gondor, my lord. I do want to try and get peace with Dunland. Approaching Walk around. Uh, there. Hello him. Dunland. Ceasefire. Proposal, but do not expect much. I don't want to really give you trade rights. I would like some trade with you. Offer you map information. I do not Just rejected. Well, that seemed fruitful. I don't Farewell. want. A, I don't want an army of Dunland marching down here and and ruining my fun. That would not be that would Ready not be good. Slay them. Okay. I think we've French done everything we want to this turn. We've moved our spies forward. We've cleaned up the Isengard rabble that was around here. We've marched Your forward our troops. Final. We're still under siege here over in the east. Mordor's sieging us up. I'm good, just wide awake. Glad you are wide awake. Then you can, uh, you know, keep a keen eye on what's going on here. Now, do I want to send these units across? I think we're fine here. I think this is honestly fine to hold. Um, I will not waste words on you. I think once we clear these ones, we'll, we'll send some reinforcements. They're also probably going to siege up this fort, which we've got a decent number of troops here, so we should be fine to defend that as well. There will be much Shouldn't be any issues. And is going to try and be way too aggressive once again. No more ships for us to deal with. I think we're good. I think we're going to come under siege at Karandros. I'm gonna trolls. There's some trolls there. But there actually are some Orkos, some Rabble, some Moran and Guard. Actually not a terribly high tier army, and there's no general. So we should be fine to defend that. Could have a couple of siege defenses in. I said we're we're just the plan is to hold our other two borders and advance on Isengard. That's the that's the plan. Captain Radgaz. The Southron Lancers is the captain, so we need to kill him if we get the opportunity, which he should, because he's the only cab unit. So we'll be able to focus him nice and easily. Alright. Let's go. Let them have it, men. Long still here with his mighty axe. Uh, he has really become the defender of Karandros. I mean, Faramir died very early and uh, didn't really get that title. Didn't really earn it. But but Long with his with his troop of axemen. Oh, look how good they look. Oh, so good. And I love, I love that. Um, this is the, the banner of Losanach, isn't it? I'm pretty sure. This isn't the banner of Gondor, and it's not the banner of Dol Amroth. I'm pretty sure that's the banner of Losanach. Because they are the Losanach Axemen. That's pretty cool. But I was going to say, I do like that in the militia units. Do we have any militia units? Militia archers? Where is it? Yeah, I like it in the militia units that even though Dol Amroth has been killed they're destroyed the, the nation of Dol Amroth is no more but they live on in the standard bearers of our units that there's still a Dol, Dol Amrothian uh, standard bearer here in amongst our, our Gondor units bearing the flag of Dol Amroth saying that that they will stand firm with Gondor 
Even though all is lost, they will stand firm with Gondor. Very nice. Shitty allies to the end, basically. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's funny. I mean, this is just going to be a massacre. The only thing that could possibly go wrong here is um, the trolls getting out of hand. But we're gonna we're going to send every art every arrow in our arsenal right at those trolls. So. I've got a lot of archers here. My goodness. Gone are the days when we had a couple of arch units here. We are really... We're really stocked up on the arrows. Let's come here. Why can you not stand there? Stand there for me. What is wrong with you? Stand here. Why was that any different? Honestly. Why was that any different? You stand here. I'll sort you Stand there. I'll sort you out. Um, I sneak... I was like just standing here or something. Yeah. Well, can you go like up the back? Yeah, yeah, that's better. Go up the back. That's fine. Good job, Good job lads. Right. You could probably go as well. I don't need you here. You could probably go to Rohan and, and govern a, a settlement. Uh, as I say that, that sort of guarantees his death this, this battle, right? I'm going to move you out. I'm going to move you away from the front. You've, you've been on the front for a long time. And I think it's time that you, you know went and had had a nice retirement govern, governing a province you know over in the fair lands of of rohan and then he dies this battle i, can, I mean i've i've i put the writing on the wall for the poor guy we actually don't have that much infantry here interestingly enough we do need to trade out some of these uh arch militia for some some decent units you uh, will have to move a little bit, but I want you set up like that. You will be like, yeah, I have to move you up. And why would why you click there but don't go there yourself? We'll never know. One unit to activate the towers, and then there we have some units in reserve. Here's over on this side. Swords on this side. Swords back over here as well. Okay. Our two, our two partly strength units we'll put over this side. No. Where did my... That was dumb. I didn't want to move you. You go to here. That's where I wanted you. You come over here. That's better. Okay. Let's do it. Archers, sort yourselves out. I want one of you sort of like... there the other one like there nice very good very good you're going to pull up to the front you lads will collapse on that flank and don't let us get surrounded and then you're ready to reinforce here where needed Okay, I think we're good. Now, as I said, the trolls are the only real concern. They are right in the back. So once they come in, we will be focusing them with everything we have. Hopefully that means they get caught up on their own troops a little bit. And the only cab unit is the captain. So this is the captain right here. If we kill him, he will, the rest of the army will route very easily. In some nice free kills at the moment. 1% killed. Have we got the battering ram up? Not yet. Ah, oh, because their, their troops got caught on. Yeah, no, there Curses. we go. The enemy are battering down our gates. Once they get on the on the gate, it will fall reasonably quickly. You, I want you to pull back about there. Close their eyes. The enemy's right ram is through our gates. <sighs> DCT Shaman, yo, yo, yo. Welcome, DCT Shaman. Welcome to the stream. How are you today, sir? The walls are no longer ours. The enemy have taken them. Give them this slot down a little bit because we really do want to hit those trolls. Where are the trolls at? Yeah, they're coming through. We really do want to hit the trolls when they make their way through. Everything will focus on the trolls.
Re, retarget fire. Don't need our own troops. Okay. Okay, everything. Get those trolls. Don't worry about these lads. You can keep shooting at the halberds or something. Shoot the halberds. Get all the Athelian rangers. Focus fire these trolls. Bring them down. Bring them down. Come on. There's still, there's still 12 of them. Bring the trolls down. Every arrow that we have. I think even the archer militia are shooting in there as well, honestly. They sort of, the, a lot of the arrows are being um, buffeted by the other units there, which sucks a little bit. They're tanking for them. They're using their, their orcs as shields. Come on, don't let them get in, don't let them get in, don't let them get in, don't let them get in. Come on. Surely. Hey, I need to, I need to refocus. Don't shoot our own troops in the back. Uh, get involved against the trolls. I mean, get, get out of get out of defensive stance. Let's go. The trolls. I mean, we 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 softened them a fair bit. Surely the infantry should be able to bring them down from that point. I'm hoping. Get these black Uruks. Running guard. Hey, there goes their captain. Oh, well done, well done. But the trolls are still involved. Guard, hit the more chosen if possible. Give it to him. How are the trolls going? Oh, there's still there's still quite a few of them. Seven of them. Doing all right. Back home from a whole day of watching the Inter College Division Wheelchair Basketball Nationals. Wow, that sounds pretty cool. I mean. Wheelchair basketball is pretty friggin' um, pretty rough. It's pretty rough. It's pretty crazy. They don't hold back, that's for sure. Kill the trolls. Kill them. Kill the damn trolls. Seriously. You seen it before? I've seen wheelchair basketball before. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I mean, I've watched a lot of it, but I've definitely watched a bit. Um, and it's it's certainly not for the timid. These trolls are still alive. You see why I focus fight them? Just to just to wear them down a little bit. Where'd you see it before? Just on TV, dude. Um, I haven't seen it in person, but I've seen it on, t on TV. Like, uh, Paralympics, I guess. I've seen it at Paralympics. Um, the enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. I remember thinking that's up there with, like, ice hockey in terms of, like, how crazy people just, like, just yeet in there, you know? They just, they just go and go nuts up. Absolutely crazy. I mean, these lads here are dying very nicely. We direct our fire a little bit. Hit these more chosen. Hit the black oak halberds. Um, running guard. There's more chosen. Uh, yeah, shoot into that clump. I think they're out of ammunition almost. These guys are actually out of ammunition, so we might just pull them down here a little bit. Get them out of the way. Nationals for College Vision is being held in my alma mater, so I had to go show support. An even gnarlier sport though, wheelchair rugby. Yeah, aka murder ball. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I haven't seen as much of that as, um, as the wheelchair basketball. But I do remember thinking it was like pretty insane in terms of what they do. Alright, so these lads are holding here quite well. In fact, we want to probably pull back the swordsmen, pull them back. Um, okay, 
Alright, let's see who we got left here. Shoot them. Full coast. And we're gonna whittle these guys down pretty easily now, I think. Who's this Morgul Chosen? They're the strongest unit left for, for Gondor here. A Gondor for bloody Mordor. Archer Militia are out. Are oh, they actually committing? Uh, so I need to be careful about my U3. Uh, shoot that. U4. Shoot this. It's a few a few brave soldiers here are holding up the advance of, of Mordor at the moment. Let's speed it up a little bit. Don't really want you to fire too much into that. Hit these guys on the edge here. Victory will be ours. Yeah, shoot them as they run away. That's a good idea. Give it to them. Hold, hold fire, hold fire. Any ammunition you have left, hold it. Uh, you guys pull back. No, 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 you, you come around. Uh, hit the sounds will definitely. The black Eriks. Anyone who's got ammunition left, shoot. Anything left? If we yep. like Even if it's just one arrow, shoot it. I played for Team USA for a couple of years before COVID happened. In wheelchair rugby. Very much in, our favor. in murder balls. Dude, that's insane. Like, that's like very high level um, competition. Um, that's super cool. Not many people can say that, you know? Not many people can say they've rep represented their country. Um, can we get our generals involved, perhaps, just so we don't lose any troops? Here we go. This is where I said this general would die. <laughs> Here we go. No. Behold how our cowardly foe runs. It's time to press the attack. That wasn't. That wasn't lost. That wasn't a, my general then, was it? Someone just died there. I didn't like the look of that. Shoot him with the towels a little bit. Been to Japan twice, Great Britain, Paraguay. Hoping to rejoin the team next season so I can keep traveling for free, <laughs> lol. The perks. Ah, there's gotta be some perks, you know. Gotta be some perks. I mean, Professional athletes, I know, depending on what sport you're in, um, often don't get like that much, you know, that much pay. Um, you know, unless you're in sort of a high profile sport, you know, normally it's pretty low, low end on the... <laughs> low end on the pay scale. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> I think we've got 85%. Yeah, we got 91%, so they're fine. We should be able to leave the battle. We killed the killed the captain. The enemy Heroic victory, vanquished. 368 lost. Who had the most this kills? 359, Athelian Rangers. Ooh, 358. Tight competition. Tight competition. 338. Gondor Defenders did well, 195. Well done. Oh, 
Oh, but trolls are only counterfeits. Made by the enemy in the great darkness, in mockery events, as orcs were of elves. We are stronger than trolls, says Treebeard. Yeah. Treebeard is actually in the game. But I don't know how he actually functions. Or how he comes out. Maybe if you're playing as Isengard. Maybe if you're playing as Isengard, he spawns. I can, because if I turned off Fog of War, um, I could actually show you Treebeard in the game. He's, he's on like the bottom of the map, just chilling there. So I think he like spawns in, in certain like events for certain factions. Here we go. Second de siege defense of the t end turn. Oh yeah, lots of cab. Is that second army coming in? No, so it's just the one general. Um, we should be able to clean this very easily. For the white city. Yeah, I mean... If I was talented enough to represent my country in a sport, uh, then yeah, I, I, I would just love doing it, right? It'd be great. Alright. Now, this is a full cav army, apart from three units. So, how are they going to breach the city? I don't know. They've got one... They're three. This is their three infantry units. Everything else is cav. I'm pretty sure everything else is cav. Yeah, so it's a full cav army except for three units. Um, and those three units are on the ladders, on this ram, and on the, on the tower. So, really, everyone needs to be just on the ground. Cav... Are going to be fairly useless. Uh, I guess I'll pull you out and then I'll just try and pincer them when they all commit. You two. Probably just hold the center. Goal is to be a Paralympic gold medalist. Ah, oh, dude. I hope you get there. I hope you get there. I mean, it's. If you have a goal. Then at least you have a chance of doing it, right? Um, if you don't have a goal, then you're never going to get there. So, yeah, I think I think uh, sometimes people are a bit people say don't aim too high, you know. But if you're not aiming higher, then you know what are you aiming at? What are you actually aiming at if you're not aiming high? Uh, Gondor defenders come here and deal with them and then everyone else is just gonna be a mosh pit honestly come in here you you come in here you two worked well last battle the combination of the axemen and the militia spears so we'll put them there um you actually come and activate this tower you can shoot some arrows at them i guess cool shoot some arrows And then our main spear units, just to put, I could, please, put it there. Once we get into the battle, I'll be able to do it a lot easier. Just don't, they're not playing ball. Just come over here, come over here, yep. Spears will be our main defense here because they have cav and lots of it. I think we're pretty happy with that. Let's go. That the pike's a little better because the pike's going to be the first line of defense against the cav charge. Warm up. Yeah, me lurking it out, hoping on some, hopping on some gaming myself. Yeah, no problem, dude. Thanks for the lurk. Very much appreciated. And thanks for dropping by and sharing a bit about yourself, you know? That's what, that's what this channel's about. Um, a little bit of sharing. Um, I was, you know, and, and quality content. 
really appreciate it. So thanks for thanks for dropping by and and, and just Give being you, you know. Oh, we've already knocked down one of their ladders. Feels good. Can we destroy the siege tower? That would be mint. Destroy the siege tower. Oh yeah, we're hitting it with fire arrows. Oh, we're not going to set 33%. We actually got a good amount on it. Can we get can we get one more shot. One more shot, maybe maybe burn it. I mean, if we burnt that, they I don't I don't think they'd actually get in. Do they have cabs? So the cab can't get up on the walls. I mean, this is gone. Seventy-nine percent. The enemy siege tower has reached our walls. They're not even climbing. Are they not even climbing? The enemy are battering down the gates. Uh, you lads need to get behind the get behind the pikes, please. What are you doing? Run here, run here. Just run back, please. Get behind the pikes. Uh, shoot the rag lances if you can. Maybe even get a couple of kills on them. Right, siege towers down. There goes half of their there goes half of their um, units. Bikes are ready. Everyone else is ready. Don't send out the cav, cav yet because we'll get minced because they have su way superior cav balls. They're almost through the gate. 80%. They are climbing the ladders. Three, three of the four the ladders are down. The so their ladder is not their ladder attack is going to be completely useless. Um, that, that attack will fail. So their only way in is through the gate. There's only one ladder. Three we ladders have gone down. Like we will smash the enemy. And let them charge onto our spear points. The enemy have the walls. To our defense or all will be lost. Yeah, look, they're already just in immediately impaling themselves. Let's go, get in there. I don't know why you're saying swords, you're actually spears, but anyway. Uh, stop firing, stop firing, stop firing. There's a lot of mass here, a lot of cav, but the cav's just gonna, it's gonna die so quick. Yeah, look at the 26%, 27%. Yeah, it's going up so fast because they're charging cav into pikes and spears and they just can't, can't do that. Can't just force through cav through, through pikes and spears and not expect to get huge losses. Uh, you guys can probably get down off there since you're getting, you're getting minced. Being minced up on the towers, so get down. They're just firing up at you. Yeah, get off the towers. Get in amongst them. I mean, look, they are. If they manage to push through and get behind my line, then they will kill us. Uh, and they are killing us quite quick. In fact, one of our units routed. But this, why are they routed? That's a concern. Um, what I want is. Around, okay. You can go as well. You lads come around. They are pushing. The enemy force remains. But we're holding. I think we've I think we've broken the the impetus of their of their attack. We've broken the impetus of the attack. Don't think they've got a lot left. 56% killed. So, I mean, if they had some more infantry mixed into the into their units, and we've still got quite a few pikes here. 74 pikes are still holding here. So, no issue there. Why would you run in like that? Can 
you guys are bonus against uh, Cav, aren't you? So this is should be should be your wheelhouse. I mean, we're actually losing on this on this flank. We've been surrounded on this flank, but other two flanks have held firm. There's still a few units here holding firm, but they should kill quite a few. It's a bit glitchy, isn't it? Ooh, ooh. Let's not look at that. Oh, yeah, they're, they're done. 70%. And let's get the other cab out. Just try and make sure none of them get away. I mean, they are trapped somewhat with our cab here in the gate. I mean, this cab has pretty much almost died, but... Cool. Oops, they, they have to completely died. Alright. General down. Attack. I don't want him to get away. Clean up some of this infantry, that should uh, tip the balance over. Yeah. Oh, well, I don't know actually because most of them have left the battlefield already. So if we need to get most of them killed, as many as we can, don't let that infantry. That's cab. We can't catch them. They're done. And if they're wind riders, we're definitely not catching them. Yeah. That says 98%, but that counts for ones that have left the battlefield as well. So just have to see. Be awed by the victory. Um, I think we got enough. Today. 92. Nice. 92% gone. But we did lose, four, lose 495 there, actually. So just the mass of the cab pushing through really did hurt. And for last Blackman, though, 171 kills. Blackman against Cav are really going to do well. And the Gondor Spearman as well. Really doing the work. I was a little bit concerned there for maybe, maybe a minute. But it looked like they might have just had enough Cav to push through and enough heavily armored cav to sort of tank the spears and the pikes for long enough to get behind our line. They did break our left hand flank, but I sort of deliberately left that left hand flank reasonably weak. No way they get there in one turn. No way they get there in one turn. Oh, they do though. Deary me. Uh, this is a concern. I wanted that other army to besiege the Show fort. Yourself. Oh, they're really coming in thick. Oh, yeah, we're going to have to send a relief force for that. We don't have much of a choice. Angmar wanes. Very nice. So Angmar is on the verge of defeat. Relations worsen with the Helm of Lothlorien. Sure, I don't know why. Erebor and Angmar have actually declared war, so yeah. Erebor's even coming across to help finish off Angmar, so they are in a lot of trouble. Uh, we can retrain units... Uh, not really, because we don't have much money. You can chuck another unit in there. I think in the Citadel Guard, for the best unit I have. And we will have Citadel Guard replenishment. Yeah, we do have Citadel Guard replenishment. We'll chuck him in there. I mean, is there anything just started building this turn? Yeah. What I want is to queue up this one. 
fun. And him. And then just cancel that. So we will get some retraining done there. And queue up something else here. Still go for the roads. Just do it next turn. Uh, now. If you're watching... Uh, that's been a very long YouTube episode. <laughs> after those two battles there. Uh, in fact, let's just... Let's stop that there. So if you're watching over on YouTube, that's going to be the end of episode... Uh, 57 so be sure to like subscribe and comment and i'll see you in the next episode have a good one